Are you tired of hearing about Logan Paul? That's great. Me too! But before we move on to the next drama that will inevitably happen and forget about everything that <laughs> that went down, there's a few more things that we need to consider. But Pills, you said bad word, so yeah, you, you are not allowed to criticize him. Shit, I forgot. Damn it. Damn it. God damn it. I keep forgetting I said the bad word. Oh well. You gotta give the Pole Brothers some props, you know? They they got a good ball game going on, you know? One person does something and all of a sudden you you completely forgotten what how bad the other one was. And then, and then just back and forth. Uh, as you can tell, Logan Paul is in deep pain after this incident. He, he's he's suffering immensely. Clearly his audience put the, put their feet down and said, "No, Logan, you you stepped over the line." A lot of people were pointing out with the uh, Suicide Forest video that it was just a mistake, okay? Everyone makes a mistake. You make a mistake too, Felix. That is true. I have. I'm guilty. Uh, but people also uh, started watching Logan's older videos and noticed a continuous pattern. So as you guys know, I'm a little sick. My voice is kind of gone. But God bless it, tomato! Uh, uh. Did he just throw a tomato on a wall? That's hilarious. To deliver you guys the most entertaining, exhilarating, incredible content ever! Please throw another tomato on the wall, because that was hilarious. <laughs> I think in honor of being sick, we're now going to be selling your official <laughs> Logan Paul mask on loganpaul.com slash shop. Get your own sick mask and prevent the bubonic plague from spreading in your town. This, uh, this one uh, is uh, just for a uh, display. Oh, so, so I can't eat yes. this. Okay, that's my bad. <laughs> How old is he? So while in Japan, Logan Paul clearly knew about the Japanese culture. They really value respect above anything. I just gotta be careful to not like disrespect the culture. Cause Logan, Japan is all about the respect. It's actually true. I know it's, it's <laughs> true. So I gotta take my chach levels and bring them down. Yeah! I didn't edit that to make him look bad. He, uh, he edited that. That was... <laughs> I didn't even have to do anything. <laughs> oh, man. This is where you throw coins into the well. You make a wish and they come true. What are you gonna wish for? I wish for health, uh, happiness, and hella bitches. There you go. You know when you're uh, in a church or mosque or Buddhist temple, there's genuinely the approach that you, you keep it down a notch. You're, you're a bit more quiet. Like, I'm not religious. Or anything like that, but even then, I sh I'd still, you know, you need to show a certain amount of sp respect. And you're at a Buddhist temple, just throwing in money in the thing, like whatever. It's so dumb. What did he do? No. Some of the authorities weren't happy about them acting this way, and their guide is the one that apologizes. He's the one that has to step up and be like, "I'm sorry." For this person. So she's saving the day with this flashlight. What did you do, Andy? Look what you I was seconds. just cleaning myself with water, and then he's like, "Out, out!" I'm sorry, the filming, the filming. Oh, it's the film. Oh, it's the vlog. All right, guys, we're gonna see you back in. Because you're at a Buddhist temple. It might be a tourist attraction, and a lot of people there. But as someone who really loves Japan and love visiting there, I'm always really on guard whenever I'm there. Like, I don't want to be that person that Logan Paul and his friends are. I don't want to be... It's not attractive. It's not someone you want to be. You know how it is in Japan, they're all about the respect. So we're gonna be respectful for a little bit. I know it's new, but we gotta do it sometimes. Literally the next... The next cut. <laughs> he's not sick. He's not sick. I'm not sick. I, don't get sick. I get that he's sick and then that's a problem, but then wear the fucking mask, dude. In Japan, it's a big deal to be spreading germs. Like, they have the masks not not to protect themselves from other people being sick. They have them, if you're sick, to not admit it to other people. It's another respectful thing that if you are sick, you don't spread that disease around. It's considered really rude to be sneezing and coughing out in public as well. And it's simple things that you could have looked up. You've been to Japan twice, you should know this. And if you think I'm just nitpicking at this point, don't worry, it gets worse. Hey, hi, mate, hi, mate. how many what? Hi, mate. Hi, mate. How many subscribers? 15 million. We just hit up. Blowing blowing up, up on YouTube. Up. It's Are you incredible. subscribed? Oh my god, Logan, can you be more unfunny and annoying? God damn it, this is just... Ugh. Uh, uh. He has no idea. Hello. Oh, 
Hi, how you feel? Logan's sl slogan, his whole identity with his his brand is be a maverick. Yeah, that's his merch. That's what he sells. That that's what he acts like. But you're just being annoying. You're just being fucking annoying. This is the sort of attitude that he's emitting towards his fans. Like, be like me. Be an asshole. Be an idiot. This is okay, you know? You just gotta be edgy. You gotta do stuff that no one else is does. But it's like, no. I get that. I get that not everyone should be the same, but god damn it, I hope no one else is like you. If you want to see the fish at the fish market in Japan, don't party with thoughts the night before. Now, I'm also not giving up hope. See, now that's what I'm talking about! So, Logan Paul goes to the fish market, uh, which is very famous, and it's already sort of shutting down because they don't want tourists in there because they're being too it's being too much of them it's becoming too much of a tourist attraction it's really just people working there it's a fish market after all and then you have logan paul of course furthering that even more by just buying fish yeah! to walk around in public with Like, you have people literally scoffing at him, but can you imagine how many of those there that is edited out? And of course, what a maverick. What a legend. I can't believe he just did that. That is le epic. Wow. I wish I was that brave to do that, because man, that's pretty edgy. I just want to say one thing though. Japanese people are so nice. Logan. Let me just explain this, because I don't think you get it. They're, they're polite, but that doesn't mean they like you, okay? They may not tell you, how, hey, fuck off, you're an asshole. But they definitely think it. <laughs> and if you think I'm nitpicking, don't worry, it gets worse. This was my life. The Game Boy Color. So Logan goes uh, to the market to buy a Game Boy. <laughs> Why? Indeed, why? Wh why? What was the joke? Excuse me, sir. The game seems to be malfunctioning. Macho broken, though. 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 The Can we Neil deGrasse Tyson cringe me? Oh my god. Oh my god. Here we go. Heck yeah, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Logan Paul clearly cares a lot about his fans when they ask for a signature. As a good good old meme, his signature is as Chew. Don't mind me, dumb American, pants coming down. Toyota, I choose you. No, no, no. <laughs> you, you gotta respect the culture. Gotcha, bitch. He's gotta catch you. You can tell her okay, gotta, how much she enjoyed this him. meme. <laughs> <laughs> Just look at his face. Oh! Hilarious. You got me. I am the Pikachu. That's what he's saying right there with this uh, with this expression. These are just the scoffs that we see. Okay? Just I'm just like imagining the ones that get cuts out. Imagine the the ones that are like, "Oh, that maybe that was a bit far." Right. Uh... This is literally just his last three videos before what happened what happened and Watching them, it all kind of makes sense why he reacted with such little empathy uh, as he did. He doesn't really look at these people as people. He, he's treating them like something else. I get it. People are tired of Logan Paul by now. I'm, I've clearly made mistakes too. I'm not allowed to criticize it. I agree 100% with that sentiment. I've always said, like I've argued with friends about Logan Paul. And people always bring up like, oh no, Logan Paul, he at least he's like the older, more mature brother. Logan is not that bad compared to Jake. I I I swear. And I'm like, mm. Mm. from one sociopath to another. Okay, I'm a YouTuber. I know how they think. I don't watch Logan's videos. I've seen briefly of it, and it's enough for me to know his character and who he is. He's the kind of guy that plugs his merch when his friend's dog died. I'm with you. The whole low gang's with you. We got your back. Yeah, it's gonna feel weird. It's gonna feel weird for the next few days. Unfortunately, it is just a fact of life. And another fact of life is literally right now, you can get your merch on loganpaul.com slash shop or link in the description. He's the kind of guy that fakes his own murder 
in front of a front of little kids as the epic meme. He's the kind of dude that invites his fan to be in a song with him, to boost his ego, and of course, plug the merch. Saw so a win, made a song about him twice. What? Song about me twice? No, and that's really nice. Yeah. Hit me up if you ever need advice. Yeah. And here, dude, take some other merchandise. Make it by him. Everybody needs someone to idolize. He's the kind of guy that makes out with his brother's ex-girlfriend. Good meme. <laughs> The kind of guy that tells people to meet him outside of VidCon when clearly told not to do that. That's a danger for everyone. Someone could seriously get hurt. Don't do that. It's no joke. I don't like Logan Paul. I don't like his type of person. He's the kind of person where I feel like if I tr even tried to have a normal conversation with, it just wouldn't work. He would always just be like, I'm a, yeah, I'm a maverick. Ah. It seemed like I got in a lot more shit for a lot less. And I, like I said, I don't think he should have any sort of repercussion or whatever from YouTube, but at the same time, hashtag bring back Scare PewDiePie season two. That's right. If nothing's gonna happen, at least bring back Scared PewDiePie Season 2. We shot the whole damn thing. Alright? It's there. It's waiting. <sighs> <sighs> Remember when plugging your merch used to be something kind of frowned upon? Like, okay. Alright. You can tell. You can do it when you launch it. Maybe you can tell it, but don't shove it into people's faces, okay? <laughs> I don't know. Squad fam out. But oh God bless it, tomato! <laughs>